Notre Dame immersive, you can experience the world famous cathedral Notre Dame de Paris like never before. In Deep Space 8K of the Ars Electronica Center, you journey through the impressive architecture in stereoscopic 3D, explore historical representations and zoom into larger than life details of the elaborate glass windows. This is part of the Ars Electronica's decades-long commitment to preserve cultural heritage and celebrate it with a large audience. In April of 2019, Notre Dame de Paris was severely damaged in a devastating fire, requiring years of reconstruction and restoration work. On the occasion of its reopening in December 2024, the Ars Electronica Future Lab has brought the Paris landmark to the Ars Electronica Center as an immersive experience, together with French startups Econem and Historbury. Notre Dame Immersive showcases the construction of the cathedral in the 12th century and its architectural features, as well as the extensive restoration work in stereoscopic 3D. The digital architecture is based on data from renowned art historian Andrew Tallon, who created a detailed point cloud of the cathedral using laser scans in 2010. After Tallon's death, the data went to the French startup Econem, whose team completed the data set using modern technology. This point cloud is the only detailed digitization of the cathedral before the 2019 fire and is therefore the central component of the digital processing for Deep Space 8K. The data of the point cloud contains over a billion points, with the majority depicting the interiors of the cathedral in detail. To be able to display these massive amounts of data in the Deep Space 8K, the point cloud was divided into different sections. In some places there are additional details to discover, such as 360 degree panoramas, 3D models and a high resolution image of the rose window of the west portal. This additional content was provided by the startup Historbury, which also provided a 3D model of the cathedral during the fire. Animated in 3D by the Future Lab, the extent of the fire at Notre Dame can thus be impressively experienced by visitors in Deep Space 8K. The project is controlled interactively via a controller, allowing the presenters to move freely between the points of interest and respond specifically to the interests and questions of the audience. In this way, Notre Dame Immersive also impressively highlights the importance of new technologies in the preservation and communication of humanity's cultural heritage. The Ars Electronica has been showcasing cultural heritage in the Ars Electronica Center's deep space since 2009. This 3D experience space enables wide audiences to immerse themselves in world heritage in stereoscopic 3D and larger than life size. For example, with point clouds and immersive walks through historical sites from ancient Rome to present day, Venice and the tombs of the Great Pyramid of Giza to a virtual reconstruction of the synagogue in Linz, which was destroyed during the Night of Broken Glass in 1938. In addition, gigapixel images let us zoom in on world-famous paintings, beat works from the Sistine Chapel by Da Vinci, Picasso, Caravaggio, Botticelli, De Goya, Klim, Chile, von Eich, Bruegel the Elder, and many more. With this commitment, Ars Electronica and Ars Electronica Future Lab aim to help preserve cultural world heritage and connect large audiences to the importance of art in human history.